Hello my fellow chunks of meat, I'm Mr. Church. Today we're going to be building a tree house in the woods. I'm going to hang it from this tree up here so that I can have a nice view of a dumb little waterfall trickling down, much like my hopes and dreams of having a normal, peaceful, and happy life. Today we're building up here on this little fun tree that juts out at a 90 degree angle. And I'm going to be showing how to float roof bits to make small floating cube structures without needing to resort to using the stair gantries and multiple floors and sadness. So I'm going to, I think, make this look like it's hanging from that tree up there. So I'm going to take some stairs and start building my way upwards. Kind of like my, my attempts to climb social ladders, except this is a success. This method has been in the game for a while, but I realized I never showcased it, so here we are having fun in the mire, one of my favorite biomes to never be in. Now, let's, uh, once we can get this to goddamn snap where we want it to, please, just do it. Just fucking go where I'm, oh my god, I'm, what the fuck, I'm looking right at where I want it, oh, I saw it, I saw it, it was just there for a moment, please, I'll give you, I'll give you some ammo. I'll give you legacy. Okay, um, let's see. Now I'm gonna come up here and see if this is even directly beneath it. Uh, yeah, that looks good. I'm gonna just put another floor piece over this way. Um, here, no, yes. We'll, we'll go down. Thank you. Jesus, lagging Christ. All right, and uh, here we go. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna build our walls. Oh my J Jesus Lord and Savior. Oh Christ, I don't have a jetpack. Um, let me just walk 10 miles and uh, I'll come back around. Yeah, we've left the camp. This is gonna be fun today. I can already feel it in my bones, down in the deepest part of my soul. Okay. It, it, now that we're directly above it, we can see that it's pretty lined up. Okay, enough. Good. Now, we're going to make the walls for our structure, and this is our chance to shine. Let's pick out any old doorway. I think I'm going to go with a barn doorway. Uh, mostly just because it's probably the best texture in the game. As far as textures that look like shit goes, this is my favorite. Um, in fact, out of all the things you can build with... What's more glorious than a, the good old barn set, A? Eh? Yeah, doesn't that look nice? Now we can go and delete these upper floors because we don't need you. We just don't. I'm gonna get rid of all, of all that. And now we can make our way over this way. No, not that one. And uh, we've just brought ourselves down one floor. And we're gonna put a upper floor here. Please, thank you, Lord. Thanks. Thank you. And build off to the side. One wall and a, f a roof. And then we're just going to work our way that way with the roofs so we can get back underneath there. And um, let me try to get up there so I can see what I'm doing. Oh, yeah, I don't have stranger numbers right now. Uh, some people don't play with that. Let me look off to the, the right. Maybe that'll let me put it down. Oh, yeah, that works perfectly. So the trick is to look exactly where you don't want to put the upper floor down, and that's where it'll... Oh my god, I just... Contractor? Thanks? Um, if you're wondering what that abysmal, disgusting cesspool was of a build, this is my nuclear winter character. I don't want to talk about it. Thanks. I appreciate it. Now, this will not let us delete this because it's holding up the roof in there, but if we change it to a slanty bit... It doesn't know that it's supposed to be holding that roof piece up over there, so then we can just get rid of it. And now we have a standalone roof piece, which we can snap other roofs to. And while you're working with these, if you ever put two down connected to each other and you need to delete one, just do what I just did, switch one to a slanty bit, and then you can get rid of it. It's pretty simple, and you don't have to deal with all that dumb uh, stuff getting stuck crap that makes us all so sad inside. Okay, this is like the box of our str- oh no. 
I don't know why I'm building here, like I really don't. I wanted one of those trees, but they're all over the mire. I didn't have to pick this place. And um, I probably shouldn't have built here without a jetpack. Now uh, let's put the roof up real quick so we don't get any of those nasty little rad showers that come every once a year and rain down upon us giving us zero rads. Which, oh no, 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 God, Jesus Christ. I love building in the mire. I love building up high when I don't have a jetpack and I most assuredly love falling and plummeting to my death. So we're in high spirits here. Let me just, oh no, oh my God. That's it. I'm sorry, that, that's that gotta be it. Oh good. Now I can't even... Oh my god, even my attempts to end it all are, th are thwarted. Alright, let's just um, pull pull ourselves together. Put a... Let, let's switch these two walls that we can't walk out of and fall 7,000 miles to our deaths. Maybe that will improve our quality of life in the mire. Just gonna switch these all. Uh, and uh, I didn't put a root. Oh, I did put a root. I put a doorway on one of these things, but I don't really know where I want to enter the entr entryway to be because I don't know how we're gonna get inside this thing. Maybe a design feature, maybe a design flaw. To be honest, I didn't really want to build here. I was looking for one of those trees that hangs down at a 90 degree angle so that I could do this. Hanging. I wanted to make some conduits look like they're kind of hanging this, uh, holding this up. By threads and of course because it's the strangler revine wood stuff it doesn't really want you to connect stuff to it and, and attach things to it because deep down it definitely hates you so I uh, just messed with this for about 10 hours and I couldn't get it down and then I said to myself why am I building here why am I building in this game and I said why am I playing specifically speaking Fallout 76 uh, and then I realized it's because I'm trying to build a treehouse I, I want to build a treehouse that's hanging down under a tree and so yeah this is looking oh my god oh that you know what that's it that's it I, I'm done alright so just take some wood and, and just uh, we're just gonna build some put it down here and uh, what what why, why are you mad treehouse Treehouse. Yeah. What? What? Treehouse. Fine. 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 All right. So we're back at the exact same spot. I didn't move my camp. I'm in the exact same place I was before. This is uh where I've always been. Um, and I think this time I'm gonna try building on top of the exact same place we were just were instead of hanging down underneath because. Let's make a little treehouse that's just sitting on top of this, this, uh, this tree. Yeah. So the same exact method, you put your walls where you want them, you get rid of the floor and the stairs, and then using the same foundation spot so that it's all squared up. Oh, hey, Billy, how's it going? Uh, we're just going to build our way over there till we have our floor. And then we're going to take it. We're gonna make it a little different. Doesn't really matter what. Just slanty bit. And then we can just get rid of this shit and we don't have to worry about it. And that, that this is gonna be the basis for our build. And if you're wondering why this is so small, um, well, it the tree must have shrank when I was on Minecraft because when I came back, it was, a, it was a lot smaller and there was a road here underneath that I don't know what happened. Um, my guess is... What's the matter, Billy? You're looking for your glasses again? Well, I'll help you look in a minute. I'm in the middle of something important. Thank you. Uh, let's see. Uh, let's put some... How about some treehouse-looking walls? That wouldn't go amiss. By the way, if you want to stack poles nowadays, there's an even easier way than I've shown before. Uh, since you can't do this anymore, because, you know, why would you be able to? Uh, you put a roof in between them that makes sense that then uh, you can yeah so there you go solved that uh, I didn't actually um, someone showed me that 
uh, I, I just steal their content and pretend it's my own. Um, but luckily, this is the kind of build that no one would ever want to be affiliated with. So I can say, hey, I made this treehouse myself. In the first try in the first location I tried. By the way, if you're ever having trouble making a location work with what you're trying to do, just leave. I didn't. This is the same spot I've always been, but you can just leave and go to somewhere where what you're trying to do is actually working. So, the other uh, advice is if it's looking too shitty, uh, first of all, don't use barn walls, and second, uh, try scaling down a lot of the, the pre-made structures in the existing locations in the game, especially the ones that look like they were made by survivors of the war and not pre-war, are all small. They Think about it, like, realistically speaking, you're not going to be able to build an entire fucking cathedral using found bricks. It's just not realistic. But a little tiny box on a tree is, and that's the power of micro-builds and clutter and uh, trying to be lore-friendly. And I even do have this little porch area for my crafting benches, because those take up space. But the main structure is this tiny little one by one, and it works with my location and my surroundings. Let me just hold on. I gotta walk out so you can see my my. my that's my good side. I'm Mr. Church, and I hope you guys appreciated this very short video. And I will see you in the next. Holy shit, that's loud.